NTUC Health provides health and elder care services to the community. We have 13 active ageing centres island-wide where seniors can get support from the community. We have a strong befriender network where volunteers visit isolated seniors two to four times a week. When this initiative was first started in 2018, home visit records and wellbeing checklists for 1,200 seniors were being done manually. The befrienders also had to travel back to the office after home visits to submit the records. In addition, there were also instances where befrienders arriving at the seniors' homes only to realise that the seniors were absent. The manual way of doing things was both inefficient and ineffective as it is also prone to inaccuracies. With our collaboration with SMU, things improved. SMU provided the technological support to digitise these processes. An app was developed for Befrienders to facilitate the submission of a digital survey of our seniors' well-being, as well as make a record of their visits. The Smart Home Visits recording system works with two parts hand-in-hand. Hand. The BLE beacon is installed in the Befrienders' home and the befrienders will have to download the application. Through Bluetooth, the home-based beacons will broadcast signals within a 5-metre range. Befrienders' smartphone detects the signal when they are near the senior's home and records data like the visit times and triggers the in-app survey. This data is then sent to the server for processing and analytics and displayed on the dashboard. This process streamlined the befrienders' experience, allowing them to focus on speaking and interacting with the seniors. Initially, the beacon was supposed to be located in our centre. However, due to COVID-19, they were placed in the seniors' homes. Through Bluetooth technology, the beacon can sync with the mobile app to record the time the befriender enters and leaves the home. This worked well during the pandemic where seniors were encouraged to stay at home for their health and safety. The surveys submitted through the mobile app are immediately accessible by our team members who can then generate insights on the seniors' mental and physical well-being. For example, we can see if the senior is exhibiting any signs of dementia, facing any motor skills issues or if they were involved in home accidents. Through this collaboration, we were able to document all these effectively. The beacon and application required both the befriender and befriendly to have access to the internet, which was not always the case. In those cases, the befrienders would wait until they reach home or go to the centre to use the centre's Wi-Fi before completing the checklist. This can result in inaccuracies as they get mixed up on the results due to the multiple visits conducted in a day. Some seniors also did not want to have the beacon placed in their homes. This results in a hybrid system where manual recording is still done for these visits. To overcome this, some befrienders thought they should just carry the beacons when they visit the seniors' homes, then turn on the app when they reach the seniors' home. This has resulted in not only keeping track of home visit, surveying befrienders' health condition through mobile app, it also brings convenience for the befriender when claiming their reimbursement through validating each visit. As the befriending program is a critical part of MOH's elder care model, technological support would help to ensure accountability and isolated vulnerable elderly are monitored. Prior to this tripartite partnership, collaborations were made between NTUC Health and SMU through the Shine Seniors Project, as well as the Singapore Data Science Consortium with SMU on a smart barrier-free access research. We also repurposed the BLE Beacon-based system previously used in the Shine Seniors Project for centre-based attendance and home visits attendance taking for this new project partnership. With the experience from different collaborations, we were excited to be on this journey with NTUC Health to not only provide a business solution for them, but to be able to assess a large-scale test bed for smart centre-based and home visits attendance taking to improve this befriending programme. 
NTUC Health's collaboration with SMU was a great learning experience. It showed that technology can not just help improve productivity, but also allow us to understand the ground challenges faster and better. It also proved to us that our staff and seniors can learn, adapt and do things in a better way. We are appreciative of SMU's and Singapore Data Science Consortium's journey with us during these challenging circumstances. Streamlining workflow and improving the quality of home visits is just the beginning. The research engineer supported by Singapore Data Science Consortium has started a company to continue providing technological support for us. We believe that this technology can be further developed to sync data across other systems to provide a more comprehensive healthcare experience for seniors.